How best are you going to look after the nurses? <coughs> Speaking to the media recently, midwife Joyce Sepp says there are also persons of interest at the labor ward. This has put the lives of pregnant mothers and babies at risk. She says there are no isolation facilities for mothers who may be persons of interest. And the COVID-19, we have so far we have um, um, POI, person of interest. We have no place to isolate them. them. Mothers are there. Normal mothers are there, as well as those POI, and we don't have pathways. We don't have isolation rooms for them. The labor ward at the Port Mosby General Hospital has been in operation for many years, and it is the only facility serving the people of NCD and Central Province. According to the midwife, the labor ward delivers over 1,500 babies monthly, and with the COVID-19 pandemic in the country, it is impossible to close the facility. In the clinic, they don't have delivering facilities. They just do antenatal check and then all the mothers are being delivered in labor ward, both normal deliveries and complications. With the increase in the number of beds, nurses and doctors have been exhausted. The midwife says there is a need for another labor ward to be established in the city to relieve nurses from workload. All the Papua New Guinea mothers are coming there. We need the government to come forward look into labor ward, create another labor ward for the NCD so that they can relieve us. They can do the normal deliveries there and then we can uh, concentrate on the complications. The midwife further highlighted the importance of reproductive health in all families in this time of health crisis. She says it is better to plan to have a baby. They need to plan to have ba their babies. They can make love but plan to have babies not just having babies every now and then. And then we are blaming the health workers. It's your job to just go on and deliver my babies and I'll be just making babies. No, we have to do something. A petition was also delivered to the government by the nurses, asking the government to address some of their issues. Health Minister, when receiving their petition, assured the nurses that the government will address their issues. We know there's a lot of stigma out there. We know that a lot of nurses that are working there are not allowed back at home. Yes. We are all trying to mitigate that at this point of time. Just bear with us with that. We still have to take it into N NEC to approve some of the, the ideas we have for the nurses. Rayon Lakingu National, MTV News.